We are given that f of two equals nine and f prime of two equals negative eight. We're asked to estimate the following function values. f of three, f of 2.5, and f of 2.25. Notice how we don't have the function or the graph of the function. All we have is that f of two equals nine and f prime of two equals negative eight. Well, knowing f of two equals nine indicates the point two comma nine is one point on the graph of f of x, and f of two equals negative eight indicates the slope of the tangent line at x equals two, or at the point two comma nine is negative eight. So to make the estimates for the function values, we will find the equation of the tangent line at the point two comma nine, which I've already graphed here on the right. Let's go ahead and find the equation of the tangent line in point slope form, which is the form y minus y1 equals m times the quantity x minus x1, where m is the slope of the line, and x1 comma y1 is any point on the line, which means in our case, the equation is y minus nine equals negative eight times the quantity x minus two. Again, m is the slope of the tangent line, which is negative eight, and the point two comma nine gives us the values for x1 and y1. And now let's go ahead and solve for y. We have y minus nine equals, distributing negative eight, we have negative eight x plus 16. Next, we add nine to both sides. Simplifying, we have y equals negative eight x plus 25. And let's go ahead and call the tangent line L of x the linear approximation for f of x, which gives us L of x equals negative eight x plus 25. And now we'll use this tangent line to approximate the function values. F of three is approximately L of three, which is equal to negative eight times three plus 25, which is equal to negative 24 plus 25, which is equal to positive one. So our estimate for f of three is positive one. f of 2.5 is approximately L of 2.5. Notice because we found the equation of the tangent line at x equals two, the closer we get to x equals two, the better the estimates. So again, f of 2.5 is approximately L of 2.5, which is equal to negative eight times 2.5 plus 25, Simplifying negative eight times 2.5 is negative 20. Negative 20 plus 25 is equal to positive five. Our estimate for f of 2.5 is five. And then finally, f of 2.25 is approximately equal to L of 2.25, which is equal to negative eight times 2.25 plus 25. Negative eight times 2.25 is equal to negative 18, and negative 18 plus 25 is equal to a positive seven. I hope you found this helpful.